right now I'm gathering materials for a build and I'm following this material list so I got this problem where sometimes the list doesn't show up in how many stacks you need for the certain block yeah so you'd prefer how many stacks instead of the total amount of blocks right minecraft uses stacks if i can spell stacks so stacks is 64 which means we're dealing with base 64 base Sixty-four, but the thing is, there's no uh, there's no representation on this base sixty-four on Minecraft, so we're left off with let's say imaginary uh, variable for for this. So we're gonna use s to represent stack. Okay. So let's one s means one stack, right? Okay, now we go on to the conversion. Let's find how many stacks is 280. So the given is 280 in decimal. So, okay. Let me just grab a calculator for you, so you don't have to. 280, if I can write 80, god damn it, divided by 64. So let's write that down. Oh, you can't. 180 divided by 64. You get 4 point three seven five we step aside for uh, this mean this means is four stacks and we take point three seven five let me re rewrite so you can understand better Now we times it to 64, 24, so what does this mean? So, uh, so this part is the leftover, if I can, wait, that, left over, that's kind of big, but okay. So that's the leftover object or item. We just bring that next to four stacks. Here we are. Uh, this is only for Minecraft, by the way. This only applies to Minecraft. So yeah. So that's the final answer. If you want to check if this if this right, we can do reverse. Um, the reverse of Division is multiplication, and obviously, we take four stacks first, right? Four times sixty four we get two hundred fifty six, and we take. 24 rewrite 256 plus 24 mind you that this is a leftover it doesn't take up to a stack so yeah we add And we have the answer.
There we are. Um, we can do another. Uh, just, you know, to prove. Okay, let's try a bigger number maybe. Let's try 1000. And see what happens. So, 1000. Mind you, that's a lot, by the way. Divided by 16, I mean 64. We get 15 stacks. So then 15.625. We take 15 aside. And we grab 0.625. We times it to, to we times it to 64, and we have our leftover of 40. Here we are. That's the answer. Um, we can check. If it's correct, 15 times 64, 960 plus 40, and we get 1k. Yeah, that's it. Super easy. This is an outro and I'm just going to cut.